the setup to make you fail was a fail in of itself. Welcome to the Mindset Elevator, everybody. Thank you so much for joining, so much for tuning in. Thank you so very much for, you know, just being here and supporting the Mindset Elevator. I love all of you guys so much, and I hope all is well with each and every single one of you. Let it be known in the comments before I really get into this video, if you feel like people have tried to set you up for failure and failed, let it be known. Listen, there could be people in your life who have tried to set you up to not be successful or to not be set up for success or for something to go awry in your plans to where you do not get to your destination or you do not get to achieve your goals or aspirations and dreams. I've been there and I've seen what people will do. They will set it up. They will dress things up only to pull the rug from right under you and to watch you fall and to watch you crumble and to watch you have nothing at all, right? People will try to set you up by putting you in situations where it seems like you failing was the only outcome. You uh, getting screwed over was going to be the only thing that happened in the end. You may see people trying to set you up by putting you in a situation where in the end they take everything from you or they strip an opportunity from you so that they reap the benefits of whatever you were going to benefit from. Or, you know, some people just have these sort of tendencies where they will even self-sabotage themselves to see you fail. So even if a situation benefits them and you, they will literally starve themselves of that opportunity just to see you starved of it as well, right? So some people will, you know, put a situation where you could benefit, you can go up, something that helps you be better, that could have benefited them as well, maybe because of their association to you. It could be a family thing. It could be a family venture, uh, you know, some sort of thing that, you know, kind of helps everybody. But because you're the different one of the group or because you're the one that stands out in the group and people could be jealous or envious of that, they will set things up in a way where they sabotage your opportunities by either being tardy or either being neglectful, uh, not doing their part, not putting forth their share, and then kind of screw everything over but then they get screwed over too but they're okay with that because you get screwed over and you don't get anything out of the situation so you know there's people who could try to set you up for failure but that in of itself is a failure is a failed venture because I don't know understand you know like it's really hard to understand you know why people would take this route why people would decide you know to you know, try so hard to see somebody fall and see somebody with nothing. But that's just the heart of some people. Some people just have a dark heart, dark spirits. Some people are just really angry inside where they would much rather see you with nothing at all. They don't want to see you with nothing. They don't want to see you elevate. And that's okay because they don't want to see somebody like you. You reap all the rewards or get everything that you want. And people will set you up every single time. They'll set you up to see you lose everything. They'll set it up in a way where, you know, or it could be the opposite of what I was saying earlier. Like they'll self-sabotage themselves, even if they could have benefited too. There's other people who will literally just, it's almost like they will set things up where it seems like, oh, this is all for you. I want the best for you. I want you to go up or you and your people to go up, you know, whatever the situation might be. And you believe them because that's what you want. You want elevation. You think these people are on your side and then they show you that they are not. And then in the end, it's like they only wanted to take it all for themselves. And you were the one to get the scraps. If that, you know, a lot of the times they just don't want you to have anything at all. They want you to be fully lacking. It was a setup because they took everything from you or they reaped only the rewards and you got nothing from the situation. You got nothing that was owed to you or that was promised to you. Everything was a lie. Everything was fake. Everything was set up in this way to see you fail, but it didn't work. That in of itself was a failure because when people think that they're going to play God, when people think they have the, you know, they are the judge and executioner of your life, or when people think that they even have the power to deny you of a good life, of a beautiful future, these individuals will be shown that no, that is not how it's going to work because you are bound for greatness and they're not in charge of that. You are bound to be different. They are not in charge of that. They didn't make you. That's not how it works. Even if it's people that you have a blood tie to. And I know because people sometimes, even if there's not a blood tie, this could be just a familial tie, either through marriage, through adoption. It could be anything, right? Where the people that are supposed to be your closest ones are the ones that are setting you up 
to either need them in the future or to be at their will or to beg them or to need them. And they set it up where you they were going to give your independence or they were going to give you a head start in life or they were going to give you something that they thought was going to help you. But in the end, it was to hurt you and to help them only or to hurt everybody just to see you not with it is crazy and it will happen. And these individuals will see that what they're doing here is not going to work for them. It's going to work out for you because you're real. You don't try to go around and try to sabotage people and take what is theirs and set them up and then try to snatch everything from them. You don't move like that. And when you move clean, when you move right, when you move real, you will undoubtedly go up in life and you know there's no limit, there's no cap to your success. And that is why when people try so hard to set you up for failure, that in of itself is going to be a failure. It will not work them setting you up and you know think i'm uh, gonna watch your demise be brought about gonna watch you lose everything right in front of them like some sick twisted movie that's not gonna work that's not gonna fly you are already on the right path so what people think that they're impeding or intercepting it's almost like a delusion it's a delusion and people don't realize how smart you are as well they know, but they don't fully know. And that is why they get showed time and time again when they try to set you up. And I've been set up in situations where people are making it seem like I'm going to get a certain thing out of a situation or this is going to be great or this is going to be awesome. This is going to help you. This is going to help us. And in the end, it was a trick. I know how to move in these situations and I know how to move with these people. Right. And I know what to say, what not to say to these people and what they tried to do was a failure because I'm still on my way and they didn't actually impede what they thought they impeded. I'm still on my path. I know who I am. I don't actually require their assistance to get ahead and to stay ahead, which is what they thought. So, you know, you have it in the bag. So these people who think that they're setting you up and they're going to watch you like some sort of evil villain. No, what they're going to watch is the opposite take place which is you realizing that yes, you've been tricked or yes, it was a setup or yes, you know, it was something here that wasn't what it was supposed to be. But no, you did not get destroyed. No, it did not, you know, damage you. No, it did not stop you. In fact, it bolstered your efforts to get ahead, you know, and the enemies keep doing that. They're not seeing that. Every time they try to attack you and set you up and take what is yours or try to interfere with, you know, the due process of you receiving what is yours or getting blessed or, you know, getting up, going to work, people trying to stop you, people trying to fight you, people trying to stop you from getting all your life's, uh, you know, dreams and desires, you know, it doesn't work that way for them. They're going to have to watch you get everything they tried to stop or everything they tried to seize for themselves and more. So even the things that they try to get from you or take from you or set you up for, it's like you are getting everything and more and some. And that's what they did not factor in. So yes, totally. Please leave in the comments if you feel like people have tried to set you up for failure and failed. Let it be known. Thank you guys so very much for stopping by on this video. I hope you guys enjoyed it once again. Thank you guys so very much for supporting the Mindset Elevator. To all my new subscribers returning, all my friends who stop in once in a while, all of you guys are so blessed and you guys are making me feel blessed and I hope everything's working out for each and every single one of you. Thank you guys so much for allowing the Mindset Elevator to grow. It is so humbling. It's so crazy. And, I, and I'm very thankful. And I hope everything in your life is growing at an exponential, expeditious rate, just how you want it, just how you like it, and that it continues in that way. All right, everybody, thank you so much and have a wonderful day. Bye.